going on here? Sorry, Your Highness. You all here, drunk. Look at my soldiers inside the palace. Aren't you ashamed of yourselves? We are in the middle of a war, and instead of keeping awake to avoid being surprised by the enemy, you're all here, drunk and sleepy. Where's hey. Your Highness? Who kept that ladder there? Who kept that lather there? Go and check the prince in the cell quickly. Yes, Your Highness. Look at you. I give all of you specific directives on what to do. And you're here. All sprawled out and drunk. Your Highness. Yes. Yes! The prince is not in the cell. <gasps> what? Somebody I placed under your care 24 hours. He's not in the cell. Now listen to me. The only way you can avoid being beheaded, all of you, is if you can get out now and bring me the prince here. They beheaded me. And if you don't want me to roast all of you alive, I am giving you 48 hours to bring back the prince here. If you find him in the company of the princess, behead two of them, bring me their heads here. Yes, Your Highness. Now, let's go. It's not late, we have to go and get them. Move it! Move! Move it! Move! Move! Gentlemen and ladies, this is the beginning of the whole thing. The Genesis. Nobody gives up. Understand? If you are know you are going to give up, you better start going back now, or else I'm gonna pull a trigger on you. Okay? Let's yes. go. My role is nobody catches following me before me. Right, you do <laughs> just hand that over to me. Yeah. 
Are you sure? Mofi will be waiting for us. I'm sure. He'll be waiting. The guard told me. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Let's do this now. Let's go. That way, my friend. What is it? Come on. This belongs to Raja. I know so. That means we are on the right track. Let's go. Move it. Move. Move it. Move.
Raja, are you sure that Missy gets to Abigail? Yes, my prince. I gave it to Salome myself. Raja, the way she... My prince, they will soon be here. I told her to meet us after the river. The boundary between us, us and them. I hope nothing has happened to Abigail. No, my prince. Stop thinking negative, but positive. My prince, here yeah, is not safe. Let's find somewhere to hide. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Yes, Princess. Are you sure this is the place? Yes, I'm sure. That is the river he told me. He said immediately we'll cross the river. They'll be here waiting for us. But how come there's no one inside? I don't know. Oh, do you want me to scream their names so they'll know we are here waiting for them? No. Let's give them some more time, okay? Okay. Let's just pray they come here because. Princess, Princess, can we go under this mango tree and hide to avoid being noticed by any passerby? This mango tree. Okay, yes, so you're right. Yes, sir.
Alle Stecken ist schon kaputt. Ruf weg. Komm. Raja, I don't know how to thank you for all this. I don't know how to... I don't know how to reward you for all this, Raja. My prince. But you saved my life. Count on me anytime you need my service. This is my father's chief maid. She's the one that helped me out of the palace. Salome, we thank you so much for everything. We appreciate everything. May God be with you. But I have only one regret. Princess, you're leaving me. Sir. But please, remember me on your wedding day. Salome. Please come. I am handing over my beloved one to you. Please take good care of her for me. Don't let anything happen to her, please. Princess. The situation now is very tense. We have to go. Bye bye. Bye bye, my princess. Salome. 
take care of my friend. You don't have problem. Raja. My prince. Please stay alive. And you too, my prince. Bye bye, princess. Kill you just like that. I dropped my gun. I want to show you what I can do to you with my bare hands. Bastard. Idiot. I'll get it done, I'll finish you. Come on, move it! Move! Move! 
What has become of my son that he no longer listens to me, his father? I know that that witch introduced into this family must have cast a spell on him. You will learn that. So this is your diabolical plan. To use your daughter as a bait to trap my son and then kill him. I told you, I told you that the enemy is at work again. Now your only son has been kidnapped right in this palace at the middle of the night. <sighs> Wonders shall never end. Who knows? Who knows if he might have been killed? I believe that my son is still alive until my guards tell me something to the contrary. Oh, Igwe, you believe that your son is still alive? Ha! Huh. Omekoku, one of Umeze. Igwe, are you no more the lion again? Are you not? Ha! Huh. You are the lion that can withstand any confrontation. Igwe, do something. Do something before the day turns tonight. Thank you, Machi. I shall do something. But not until I have heard from my guards. Did you find my son? Did you see him? Did you bring him back? Maybe much is right after all. All right, you can go now. Go. Go. Whoever planned to kidnap my son does not know the meaning of my name. Nana, by kidnapping my son, you're not playing with fire, because water can douse fire. You are daring the mamba. I hope you can stand my response. I sincerely hope you can, Nana. The guards are back. The guards are back. And they could not bring my daughter back. Hey. What? Why? I want her. I want her against him. But she would not listen. Hey. See what she has cost. Hey. Igwe, does it mean that those guards dictate to protect her? We are not competent enough? I suspect sabotage. Hey. There is something fishy. Really fishy. There is something fishy, babe. How can the enemy come into your palace and take her away? I will tell challenge. <laughs> Those guards must be patient thoroughly. Yes. And punished. Yes. If found guilty. Oh, wow. Thoroughly punished. Thoroughly punished. My good chiefs. Ibe. Ibe. The people of Umueze have insulted us enough. Yes. Hey. Enough is enough. They are calling for war. Yes. They will get it. But my daughter must be found. Then, the blood of every Umueze person shall flow on their streets. Bam. Be it children, <laughs> pregnant women. Yes. In fact, 
every single being must smell our wrath. Hey, Bobby, where do, you, where do you think you're going to? Oh, my God. Buffy, why, why are you looking like this? It's a long story. Where have you been? Everybody has been looking for you. Bobby, please, mm. can we at least go inside and talk? Why not? Let's go in, let's go in. That's what you said. How can we stake our happiness for a tussle over a piece of land? Imagine how people go about killing themselves. Making enemies for just a piece of land. The land that will finally claim them. Well, it's ignorance. I'm so sorry for everything. Okay? Um, as for the house, it's as good as yours. You two can stay here as long as you want. Feel free and be comfortable. Bobby, you've been so wonderful to me. No, don't. What are friends for? I suggest you both remain steadfast to your commitment. The enemies must realize their mistakes one day. Love knows no tradition. Just know yourselves and believe in your decision. Um, I think I should run along now. In case you need anything, just feel free. The house is all yours. But remember, I'm not a good cook. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm sure we can manage. It's okay. Muffy, have a nice day, please. I'll see you guys later. Okay? <sighs> Sorry too. Ah. And you know I'm a key member of the church and also a committee member. You know, sometimes we need to create time for God, you know? Sure, sure. Um, I just came just to, to make sure that you're, you're still coming tomorrow as we planned. Uh, why sure? Are we? That's no problem. That reminds me, Mike, you did your traditional marriage last month without even giving me a card. I'm not happy with you. I am not at all. I'm just telling you. Well, I'll try my best to contact you. But I was told that you traveled. Anyway, how was the ceremony? It was swell. We thank God. Um, that reminds me, Bob. I went to your house yesterday and I met a couple. Who are they? That was just a friend. I'm just giving a helping hand. Don't tell me that they are just seeking for accommodation. No. Uh, it's just that uh, they have some problems. The accommodation issue is just uh, temporary. Anyway, it's just that I dig the babe. You did what? I said I dig the babe. Is anything wrong? Mike, when will you stop? You told me you did your traditional marriage just last month. And you're here digging under babe. In case you don't know, know it now. They are engaged. Engagement or not, as if you don't know what is involved. After all, they are not married. I still have the chance. Not in this one. Uh, sorry, Mike. I have to run along. I have to make preparation for our to Ghana. Ghana? Yes. I am interested. Why can't you protect me? Not in this one. Please, uh, this is an official matter. You know, even the directors are also going with us. Huh? I will see you later. Just take care of yourself.
Well done. You will lead this mission. And you'll go by air. The informant will be waiting for you at the airport. No point disclosing his identity. He's a renowned son of the soil and very reliable. You must not fail in this mission. Bring her home here alive. You will leave tomorrow morning. You can go now. May you live forever, Your Highness. Thank you. Ndioma. I am expecting some visitors tomorrow. And I want to entertain them with the all maiden dance. I want you to arrange that dance. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Your Highness. You can go now. Traveled this morning with Murphy. Traveled? I should have known that. You mean he he didn't inform you he was traveling? No, he didn't. Oh. Anyway, when he comes back, tell him that I called him. I will tell him. <laughs> Thanks for calling. Bye. Have a nice day. Let me help you. Bye. Bye bye. Highnesses, on behalf of the state government, 
this meeting is to broker peace between your communities and to find a lasting solution to the problem of the disputed land. As you all are aware, it is the prerogative of the government to safeguard the lives and property of her citizens. Government cannot fold her hands and watch her citizens live in fear. Now, I want your cooperation in this matter. So at the end, peace shall reign. Thank you very much. Thank you, Honorable Commissioner. <clears throat> you see, I wonder why this piece of land is always referred to as disputed. When every Tom, Dick, and Harry know that that land belongs to who is it? Honorable Commissioner. You have spoken very well. But with my colleague there, Igwe Omekakulu, what he has said is false. You fault. Because I remember vividly when I was 16 years of age. My grandfather let Igwe Nana Omeruaha used to farm on that land and that was pre-colonial era. Yes. Even my late father used to farm on that land. They used to take me a 16-year-old boy with on the hand and they used to drag me to the farm. It was only when This Igwe, Omekokulu, came to the throne. Did he realize that that land belonged to them? Your Royal Highness, Igwe Nana, with you respect. You said that at 16, your grandfather, your father, were both taking you to that piece of land to go and farm. Let us be reasonable. Let us be realistic. At 16, you couldn't have known who owned that land. At 16, you couldn't have occupied yourself with the right ownership of that land. Furthermore, the fact that your father and your grandfather farmed on that land is no indication that the land belonged to them. Yes, it's not. Huh? You are right. I mean, it may have been leased out to them. You don't even know. Igwe Yes. I want you to know that at the age of 16, I could differentiate between what was right and what was wrong. Yes. You're correct. And I was telling you that my grandfather and my father took me to that land for farming and they told me a lot about that land. How come? that your grandparent and your father did not query about that land until you came to power. Oh. Good question. You see, there is something I want you to know. What is it you want me to know? What do you want me to know? Are you telling me about I see. Calm down. We are here for settlement. Not to worsen the problem. You see, be advised that if you refuse to comply, that the government will take adequate measures to redress the situation. Having said this, since both of you are laying claims to the land, you are expected to forward to this office from today documents showing proof of ownership Do you have any question? Uh, thank you very much, Honorable Commissioner. You see, 
There is something. There is nothing you are going to tell me in this place. I am addressing the honorable commissioner, not you. There is no commissioner. You will stand. Come down. Read the documents. Go on. Like fire in the depth of the heart. Uh. Anger, hunger, trial, the other the day. Why are we killing and fighting now? Destroying the world. Yeah, that is one of the best things. And no peace in the world. And we love you. You don't bring people to the location, you don't have to add. Look at my teeth! I lost my teeth here! Yeah. Hey! And the love I'm not looking like a, now looking like a Dracula. I don't want to love in the world. I want to love to survive. You do a song moving. Hey! Why are we killing and burning and shooting, destroying the burning now? Love 